guys welcome back to my channel i hope you guys are all good and everything so today we're back with a new video a video that i haven't done um i don't think ever and i'm really excited for it so today i'm going to be showing you guys what i do to keep my skin moisturized and soft and lumptious during the winter time i'm about to take a bath but i just want to show you guys some of the products that i use and how i use it so if you're interested in this video please stay tuned and please also subscribe to my channel and also please press that notification button or even share this video with a friend just so they can you know get more information so number one tip during winter guys let me just tell you the number one tip is to always exfoliate because it's winter skin tends to get dry your skin tends to become flaky and you know we don't want that okay we don't want cracks we don't want flakiness we don't want dryness we don't want grayness we don't want that so the best thing is to exfoliate as well in winter we have so many layers so many layers of clothing um, that kind of makes your certain parts of your body a little bit more hotter or moist you tend to sweat in certain areas so during winter i've been seeing from myself that i tend to sweat in between my thighs and very close to my vagina like i sweat like crazy there um and i don't sweat anywhere else but there oh yeah and my bum cheeks because of so many like layers and obviously because i'm thick friction and it's just yeah summer is worse but winter just is uncomfortable because the rest of your body is like dry and then there's this area that's just you know what i mean so i think the best advice i can give you is for you to have a body scrub a body scrub during winter is the best thing in life it will help you with almost everything so so i made my homemade body scrub what i used is i used brown sugar i put a little bit like a teaspoon of um witch hazel i also put a teaspoon of tissue oil because as much as you want to exfoliate your skin and remove dead skin um you also want to leave your skin moisturized you don't want to leave it dry so it's very good to add your favorite oil to it just to make sure that your skin is not stripped from its moisture so it is what did i mention um witch hazel tissue oil some lemon juice um, freshly squeezed and brown sugar so basically let me show you guys close up Oops. You know, kind of looks dry. You just need to mix it in. Literally, that's how it looks. Best thing, when I exfoliate, I just make sure that I use some tissue oil. So this is my favorite tissue oil currently. It is a tissue oil from Clix. I also use the Bramley um, tissue oil. Um, that's just at home. I usually use that one, but this one is for more of the certain areas. So what I'll do with the Bramley tissue oil, I'll literally mix it with Vaseline, just classic normal Vaseline, and then add that tissue oil with it, mix it around, and that's how I actually moisturize my skin. If I do not do that, I add the tissue oil with my Nivea um, lotion. So this is oil in lotion, cherry blossom plus Jehovah oil. To be honest, I feel like it's not thick enough for me. Um, I would prefer the Nivea rich moisturizing. It normally comes in a big tub. I'll just put the picture on the side. Basically, that is more moisturizing compared to this, but obviously if you're a person who suffers from oily skin and so forth, this is the best because it's light, but I still feel like I need additional moisture, so that's why I add tissue oil with this. Sometimes I even add Vaseline. Guys, Vaseline, we all grew up with it. So don't be ashamed to use it. You don't need to use these fancy products um, that might not do any difference to your body. So don't be afraid to use the classic things. Um, my family has always been using Nivea and Vaseline as a combo and the I do the and same. Then, um, just to make sure that certain areas, not only on my face, but also certain areas where there's ingrown or discoloration, especially in between my thighs. I don't do this all the time, but I do it when I can. 
Um, I use aloe vera gel. Not you guys can see. Um, this aloe vera gel is um, apparently supposed to do miracles. To be honest, I'm definitely seeing the difference on my face. My face is looking really amazing, really smooth, moisturized, and my pimples are gone. So I have no complaints. This um, aloe vera gel with vitamin E um, is definitely working. It's from Vit Vitality, sorry. Um, I got this from Take A Lot. I really do feel like it does work, but I definitely am trying to see if it will help um, on my bikini area with when it comes to ingrown hairs. I haven't seen a direct result of it, but let's see. Anyway, I feel like I've done enough talking. Now let me jump into the bath. Um, to be honest guys, there's more stuff that I actually use for my body to keep really moisturized But these are the standard things that I think anybody can get which is also affordable and more simple So let's get into the bath and let me start exploring it, okay? Found the one you should never give her up. I think it's the way life changes when in love, yeah. I surround my soul with the positivity. That's why I don't worry about the things that I don't see, yeah. These days I don't worry about much. I think we should have some more fun. I still dream about the days when we were young. I'll take a hit and still finish and run, yeah, yeah. Too far away from our hearts, yeah, yeah The ones we keep close, we should never let go So tell me who you love, baby Take a moment to unwind, fix yourself And realign yourself with the world, baby Breathe slow, baby can see my skin is glowing my skin is sparkling my skin is moisturized so basically I know some people probably would have been expecting a long video of me describing so many products but it's just simple guys I think the best way that I can tell you how to keep your skin moisturized and soft during winter is over or moisturized but if you're a type of person that tends to sweat um, pores tend to open up because of the sweat glands and all that stuff if you are that type of person then I wouldn't advise you to do that but for me I'm not a type of person that sweats really easily I don't get hot too easily unless it's summer you see what I mean but in winter it's really cold so I'm able to over moisturize so I just over moisturize with my favorite lotion and I put tissue oil or any sort of oil. You could put coconut oil, um, you could put a java oil, you could put any sort of oil that you feel. Um, you could put shea butter oil, you can put any oil, you don't have to put tissue oil. I use tissue oil because of my discoloration between my thighs and um, some uh, marks from ingrown hairs like on my bikini area. That's the only reason why I use tissue oil. And you know, Bramley provides really affordable tissue oil. So I use that for my whole body, but the more expensive tissue oil, like the one that I showed you from Clicks, I think it was 120 for that little bottle. I use it for certain areas such as here, um, um, some stretch marks on my boobs literally they're gone but I've been doing it since I was a teenager so it's just a force of habit 
Um, I tend to put it on my tummy area as well and on here where my stretch marks um, show a lot. I tend to put it in between my thighs, um, the tissue oil, because of the discoloration there. And also just to make sure that it stays moisturized so um, you know my dead skin doesn't flake. Um, also it's very important to exfoliate. Um, you can buy any body scrub from any store, they always um, have body scrubs. You can do any sort of body scrub as well, you can do black coffee, you can do um, salt, you can do um, brown sugar that I did, it is your choice. You do not have to go according to what I do, these are just what I do to keep moisturized. So yeah, that's literally what I do. Um, in terms of keeping moisturized and everything and I think just listen to your body listen to your skin um, do what's best for you um, also use exfoliating gloves if you feel like you can't you're not getting the effect just using your hands just do that so yeah guys basically what I'm trying to say is exfoliate use a good lotion or moisturizer and always use some sort of oil um, that will keep your skin looking healthy, glowy, um, moisturized during the winter. So I hope you guys really liked this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Also, please do subscribe to my channel, press the notification bell, and we are trying to get to 10k subscribers by the end of the year. So please um, share with a friend as well. I'm going to love and leave you guys. Look after yourselves. Continue to stay safe. Peace, love, and light. Till next time.